God had made a lot of promises to Abraham, but it was through worship that he realized them all. All the promises God made to Abraham, as you investigate this thing about worship, you notice that it all happened through worship. First of all was that God said to him, I'll make your name great. By lifting God through worship, Abraham became great. His name became great. He became the father of many nations. But here we also see that he became a blessing to the world because his worship created an epiphany for God, stirred God, gave God an awareness, gave God a revelation that altered Abraham's life and altered the course of human history. This is what can happen when we dare to worship. We can change the world through worship because we, we change how God looks at the world. We change how God sees things. I, I'm going to talk more about that when I begin to look at the ultimate worship. You're going to see how what Abraham did inspired the sacrifice of Jesus on the cross. You see, the true value of your worship, the true value of your worship before God is not just in your love, for him it's not just in your love for God but in what it costs you to express that love 